hello guys welcome back to my channel something very simple we're going to be doing today just testing out some presets on the transparency tool so drag in the image you want to use so this one um, as you can see the name here i'll try to link these images or maybe the raw file of this corel draw in the description below so drag in the uh, flare here or this light and uh, let me just put all the things i need together in one space so bring this in here this way bring this uh glowy substance permit me to use that i don't know what it is but this sun looking image so what you want to do is go to transparency tool click on it and so like you must have seen it in the thumbnail or in the beginning of this video want to create uh, a cinematic uh, look or a sunset kind of look or you know some photographically stunning stuff on this guy so click on the transparency tool then come here ignore all these presets here and come just to this place here this merge mode then click on it okay before you do that go back to your pick tool bring this reduce it a bit drag reduce and put it on the image and as you do so go to your transparency tool and come to this merge mode here click that drop box and go straight to screen so when you get to screen enlarge this a bit and there you go usually you find this uh, kind of thing being done by guys on photoshop and all of that but there you go now can you create this one from scratch well depends on what you're trying to do let me just try something so create this uh, this circle here choose this uh, magenta color remove the outline come to bitmaps convert to bitmaps check this box transparent background click on it okay click on it and drag a bit now you want to go to effects go to blur now remember i'm using corel 2020 so go to blur and then go to gaussian gaussian blur depending on how you pronounce that so click this one and drag it all the way here all the way down until you have this glowy stuff yeah that's good looks good to me okay now you have that now this is enough this is the good looks good enough now bring this one somewhere here now this may not be as good as the other one we have but at least we'll get something now what you want to do is come to transparency tool again click on again ignore this then just come here then screen so you have this now this is not perfectly done but you get the point right you get the point good so just find a way to take this somewhere around there uh, somewhere there that way and then if you want to reduce transparency you can come here reduce transparency from using uniform transparency please uniform transparency so you have that there so you can click this and drag this over your image just to have that cinematic look now let's go to the second one where you have text so first of all let me just draw a rectangle pick uh, calling up rectangle to give it pure black make sure that is the black black yes black so let me come here and type this okay so let me type here the black oh, sorry let me um let me say fast and furious okay so that's black so let me just click and drag it let me give it a white color fast and furious okay so is this font i like uh it's called super uh something that one good anyway so uh, let me break that apart Control k to do that so let me bring this here click on this now i don't have this in italicized form so uh, let me just do this trick here and do this and take this now this i downloaded already you will find it in the link below the description so let me put it just a uh, shift page up to bring it up then go it go again to your transparency tool click on this merge mode drop down and come straight to screen remember screen so there you go screen increase it how you want it you can have that that way then uh let me click and drag duplicate it down here as well and duplicate it down here as well good so there you go 
simple as it looks thank you for watching you can like and subscribe let me know your thoughts in the comments below be sure to come back for more later and keep creating have a nice day Bye.